Welcome back to another episode of The Space, a mindful podcast that's not like the others. I'm your host, Casey Donovan. Together with Amy Malloy, we use every Thursday to share ways to feel like your best self, even when you feel like you're in a bad patch. Tonight, we're continuing our theme of April Fool's Day. If you got fooled today, we hope you found it funny. The fact is, very few of us like to be embarrassed. But it happens on some levels on a weekly basis. You tripped over running to the bus. You felt stupid in a work meeting. Your kid embarrassed you in the supermarket. Embarrassment is a very individual feeling and is often made worse by fear, according to experts. None of us like feeling stupid. So, how can you cope mindfully when the joke's on you? Tip 1. Label the feeling of embarrassment. It's even better if you can say it out loud. Try to avoid saying, I am embarrassed. You're not the physical embodiment of embarrassment. In that moment, you're feeling embarrassed, or you have embarrassment. Labelling it can be enough to take the edge off. It's a reminder that it's just a thought. That thought doesn't mean you have to take action. You don't have to change yourself as a consequence. Tip 2. Visualise a colour fade-out. If embarrassment was a colour, it would probably be red. Red face, red feelings. When you feel embarrassed, imagine that colour in your mind. Now, fade it out. See it fade to a dark pink then light pink, then cream, then white. Different colours can change our moods, even if it's only in our imaginations. Tip 3. Think of a time you've been a spectator. We've all borne witness to someone else's embarrassment, How long did you think about it? Probably not long. Did you dwell on it? Unlikely. Or did you move on and forget about it? People don't care half as much as we think, according to research. It's called the spotlight effect. We think people notice us far more than they do. In a good way. The moral of the story? Embarrassment is uncomfortable, but it's also erasable. Name it. Fade it. Keep it in perspective. We've all been there. I'm Casey Donovan and you've been listening to The Space. We're back tomorrow with another mood-boosting episode. How to be a good enough person. Space out.